Have you ever wondered what it's like to explore the underwater world of a sunken ship? Well, join us today when we do just that at Kane Garden Bay. Hello, and welcome back to our channel. We've truly enjoyed sharing our first cruise ever on the NCL Escape. On our last port day of the trip, we stopped in Tortola in the British Virgin Islands. We booked an excursion through the cruise line to go to one of the best beaches on the island. We got in an open air safari taxi and took a very windy route to Cane Garden Bay. This was a great beach. You could rent two lounge chairs and an umbrella for $20. There were a lot of shops and restaurants all along the beach. We got ourselves set up really quickly so we could get right into the water. You could even hear the steel drum music from the beach while floating in the ocean. Pepper got a tip to swim just past the pier to find a sunken ship to snorkel. We headed straight there. We were so lucky to be able to get to this wreck from shore. You could see so clearly inside the hull of the ship. I even saw a shy octopus in one of the chambers. The fish and other sea life had taken over this vessel. Sunken ships like this create an entire ecosystem all by themselves. Some of the fish were so big and they all hung out at this corner of the wreckage. This part of the ship was broken off and you could explore it separately. There are thousands of wrecks in the Caribbean, with several hundred sunken ships thought to be in the waters around the Virgin Islands. Once again, we packed our own snorkel kits, including prescription dive masks. There'll be links in the description box below for all of our gear. Some of the most beautiful moments were seeing the schools of sparkling silver fish. There was a buoy tied to the ship to help you locate it. And it was right in front of the bright yellow house there on the beach. Garden Bay is situated on the North Shore, about five miles west of Roadtown, and it has free daily access. One of the highlights was this bright orange little fish that was trying to lead the way. Sunken ships like this act like artificial reefs to help re-establish the ravaged ecosystems of the Caribbean. That's why it's important to make sure you only wear reef-safe sunscreen so that they will be around for generations to come. If you're 
liking this video so far, please don't forget to like and subscribe. There was such a wide variety of fish to see, so many colors, and I loved seeing the blue tangs. Snorkeling is truly one of the most relaxing activities. We could have stayed for hours. I loved looking at all the fish, from the big ones to the schools of tiny fish hiding out in the ship's compartments. Thank you so much for watching today. We really hope you enjoyed this video. We've got a lot more coming your way soon on Core 4 Adventures.